Well, rat, mold, and broken appliances. That is how one mother described her living conditions at a North Houston apartment complex. The woman is running into roadblocks now when it comes to getting issues resolved and finding a new place to live. She reached out to KPRC2 for help and spoke exclusively to our Rochelle Turner. And Rochelle joining us now from the Cranbrook Forest Department on Ella Boulevard with her story. Rochelle. Daniela, Ms. Roselle has lived at this complex behind me a little over a year and says rats have taken over her apartment. It's gotten so bad that after she drops her son off at school, she actually stays in her car and her son recently got sick because of mold. Today, I spoke to an attorney from Lone Star Legal Aid and they provided helpful tips for tenant rights. This is the mold right here. This is what Ms. Roselle's bathroom looks like at the Cranbrook Forest Apartments in North Houston. The mother is also dealing with mice and rats in her kitchen and bedroom. It's kind of like starting to mentally mess me up, like, honestly, because I anything fall, I be jumping, I be looking. Roselle says she submitted work orders to management. The next day or so, they'll come back saying it's completed and uh, submitted and nothing ever happened. She receives help from the Houston House. Housing Authority and says the agency stopped paying her rent because the complex failed inspections. It left her with a balance. I feel like I shouldn't have to pay it. I spoke to a staff attorney with Lone Star Legal Aid who says the situation can be tough on tenants. The Housing Authority will not be paying out the rent anymore and the tenant will most certainly lose the apartment without the ability to make that rent. When it comes to work orders not being completed, Treble recommends sending a certified letter to management and give them time to respond. If that doesn't work, a tenant can fix the problem on their own or sue management in small claims court. I really think that it takes tenants being really proactive, you know, um, and go ahead and get in a request to the to the housing authority. Don't wait around for that property to fail. There's nothing further I can do any commentary. I went to the front office and management wouldn't answer any questions. Roselle says she's had enough and she hopes she can move out soon. I moved to Houston, kind of relocated, thinking like I can get myself together, but this have kind of like brought me down. I barely can sleep at night. And Lone Star Legal Aid did provide a number for tenants that need help. Their number is on your screen, 713-652-0077. You can call them and they will start the process of getting you some help. I did reach out to management through email, but I have not heard back as of news time. Reporting live from North Houston, I'm Rochelle Turner, KPRC 2 News. Oh, there's a